Hey Patreon, it's been far too long. And I wanna thank you first and foremost for you loyal patrons that have made it possible for me to just survive and try to get to the point where we can start uh, PrinterBot again in some form or fashion. But uh, as many of you know, my garage, don't, don't pan back, but my garage is filled. But we have managed to reduce down the things, give away a lot of stuff. And we have a few more simple pros, and it's, it's sort of a recurring theme here, right? Because I had a lot of them. But I have 50, give or take, more that I can ship. And they look like this. So this is only U.S. And uh, I think in the past we were doing 125. I'm going to do one last price drop for one more week. And this is a Simple Pro, just the metal parts. So it's the powder-coated case. It's the machine parts. You'll need extruder, hot end, electronics, wire. You can take an old printer bar, printer bot and convert it over to this, but understand you're gonna have to source things yourself. But it is a great opportunity for quality parts. $99, final price, 50-ish left. So uh, I don't care who you are, that is a great deal um, if you've got a little ingenuity and you can build printers. So I'm gonna be counting down 50, uh, $99, shipping included. What you need to do is go to pay, uh, PayPal, abdrum at gmail.com, donate the 99 bucks. I'll thank you with a box of these printer parts. Now, for you guys that already have them, there's a few parts that you might want that, and here's how we're gonna do it. Um, it's gonna be a little messy, but I will uh, offer you these. So, and I, just pay for shipping. Um, it's gonna be a pain to figure all that out, but. Uh, you might want to use the ribbon cable. I have a bunch of ribbon cables. Just ask for it. Uh, I have a bunch of these little um, breakout boards that make it possible to use that ribbon cable and keep it nice and neat inside the printer like, the, like it was designed. I also have about 20 of these. Uh, these were the original. Uh, this has all the parts, but... A full complete set for the extruder. These are the nice machine parts. I had to go up and buy some more um, little parts that fit on the back there. I have a bunch of those now. I might be able to to get 50 of these, but I gotta get some more parts made. But I know I have 20 in house. So these will be $30 shipping included. If you want an extruder, just say Gearhead Extruder, and donate the uh, $20. You can leave notes in PayPal as well. Uh, 30. $30, shipping included. Okay, so that's that. Now, um, a couple other fun things. I have a bunch of these screens. Now, I know that the cloud is dead, uh, but if any of you are interested in playing around with one of these, um, these have a, a very nice touch screen. They have, um, on the back, you can see an ESP8266, um, an SD card slot. It's a ARM processor. These things are pretty cool, but nobody has uh, messed around with firmware um, successfully yet. But if you want something to play with, just request one of these and I'll ship it for the cost of the shipping. I have a bunch of them. Um, last thing, just uh, two days ago, uh, Phil informed me that Clipper is now working with the old uh, G2 printer board. So this was originally running Tiny G with the new Clipper release, which uh, requires a Raspberry Pi and a bunch of configuration stuff. Uh, it's not for the faint of heart, but if you have one of these G2 boards, um, I have a few of them too, so if you wanna request these, uh, I should have enough to, to fulfill those orders as well. Again, just cost of shipping if you wanna play around with Clipper on one of these boards. You may have one. And he showed me a uh, video of Clipper just beautifully printing. Um, again, it's early days for Clipper, but it does work with this board now, which is pretty exciting for those that have them. The filament is gone. What I did was uh, just kind of let the orders die down, and then I went to a, a school, a hacker space, um, and just donated the rest of it. So there's some very happy students that are going to be using that, and I feel great about it. It also freed up some space in my garage, which is nice. We're finalizing our plans to move 
Um, it, it will be this summer for sure. We're trying to figure out exactly when, but understand that I'm in the throes of trying to pack, showing the house, finalizing plans. Um, so the pay, the you patrons have been so patient. I know I've been completely out and I apologize for that, but it's just necessary to get my life settled so that I can uh, get some steam up again. So just wanted to thank you, let you know, I will be going on a trip this week. It's a working trip to make ends meet. Um, I'll be back next week in the middle of next week. So uh, my wife and uh, we've got help to ship these boxes. So those will be moving as soon as you purchase. I, I should say donate. Uh, but anyway, so thank you again. I look forward to seeing you next week. I'll, if I can't do, um, it doesn't look like I can get back to the 4.30 Thursday thing until we land. So it may be a while, but I'm going to be doing more of these videos and I'm always available via email. Okay? Brooke at printerbot.com. So that's it. Thank you all again. Looking forward to what lies ahead. Have a good week.